Hi, good morning guys and welcome back to my channel. So I hope you all had a really lovely Christmas, even though it's not really what we expected at all. I hope you had a lovely Christmas. Like for us, it was much, much different. Normally every year, our Christmas would be pretty hectic. We'd have so many people come over. But yeah, it was pretty nice just to have a taste of what Christmas could be like if we did it differently. So today now, I'm gonna show you what I got for Christmas. Yeah, let's just get into it. So I'm gonna start off with my little stocking, which has a fairy on it. I think this is my first ever. I got two stockings from when I was younger and I just kept the same ones, it's really cute. And it says fairy wishes with a little blonde fairy on it, if you can see there. Here's my little blonde fairy. And we always, so we always, our tradition is we go into my mum and dad's room in the morning um, and open all our stockings together. So I had some dairy milk buttons. I had this, this company um, close to where I live called the Good Wash Company. And it's so, so nice. So I got myself, or my parents got me or Santa got me rather. It's a body wash, it's a lavender and rose geranium. Oh, and I forgot to say, the good thing about this year, basically, every year, everyone does it. They write a Christmas list of what they want and what they, well, yeah, what they want really. This year, I only had two things on my list because I really couldn't think of anything, which was pajamas and socks. But because I, I liked it this way rather than doing a list, it probably isn't the best for everyone because no one knew what to get me. But I loved it, it was such a nice surprise. Saying that though, I did, well, so my mum wasn't happy because I kept buying myself stuff and you know, you buy yourself stuff over Christmas, no one knows what to get you. And basically, I told her that there was one more thing I wanted to get before Christmas, which was, Soph was doing a collaboration with Skinny Zip. And that collaboration came out after my mum told me not to buy anything. So I said, can I just buy this one more thing? And she said, yes, that's fine. So, I've got a few things from the Soph collaboration and Skinny Zip collaboration that I just thought were really, really cute. So the, I got these two rings. It was um, the stacking rings and they both have moons and stars on them. But one of them is just like filled in and the other one is a bit more gaffy and spacious. I don't know if you can see them there, but they are really, really lovely. Then we had these moon and star earrings, which are really pretty. Is also this thumb ring which looks really cute so i'm actually gonna put it on now but it's really really cute and then these two ear cuffs which i wore on christmas day so one of them's just a star and then the other one is a bit of a thicker band and it has like a half moon and a full moon on it so then in keeping with the theme of jewelry was this rose gold ring but it's not just any ring right it's a stretchy one it's a really good quality one but it's just made it doesn't feel tight or anything when you put it on it's just made so you can put it on anything really it's a bit of an adjustable one so then i also got some cucumber mint burt's bees lip balm some hand sanitizer because we all need some of that this year a pocket deodorant an elemis hydro boost sensitive day cream because that is my favorite one and i just ran out of that one as well and then the ever so traditional chocolate mini so then after we do our gifts we go downstairs and open our presents from under the tree Right, so for my mum and dad, I had some strawberry and lime cobweb gin in a massive, massive case because I always go to Asda. That's the one place I can find it, but they've been running out of it quite lately. So I got this massive, massive case of strawberry and lime gin, which I might actually crack open tonight, to be honest. I also got this winter edition Oreo biscuit tin, which has a golden Oreo, an original Oreo, and a chocolate brownie Oreo. So the next, this is actually another one that I knew of, was these giant bags. It's a kilo bag of peanut m and And basically, I ran into Home Bargains and I couldn't think of anything I wanted. And I saw those and I was like, oh my God, I need those. And I think I bought these about two or three months, probably two months ago. Or maybe it was last month, I don't know. But I saw them and I wanted them and I thought, hmm, mum's struggling with things to get me. So let's just put them to one side and have them at Christmas. Because that also gives you an excuse to eat them without looking like a pig. And another thing that I knew of as well was also from the Skinny Dip and Soph collection, collaboration collection, and it was this Goodnight Moon, um, it's like a baby blue cropped jumper with all the moon faces on it, and it's really pretty and really soft, and I was so excited for these, I'm so excited that I finally get to wear these now. So then carrying on with the clothes part of this, I also got this super dry 
pink jumper dress for my parents which is really really pretty and so soft on the inside and I can't wait to wear this as well I love jumper dresses and then I also got these oh they're so cute it says restless angel and it's a lounge suit from Blue Avenue and it's so so soft like so so soft the inside is honestly so fleecy and soft and cozy and it's just a dark gray and that came with pair of joggers which are full length with a cuff on the bottom and just like a little contrast stripe down the side they have pockets these are also fleece lined and then all across the drawstring it says boo lounge and the drawstring is actually really soft as well it's like a kind of fluffiest fluffy-ish material and then the last thing that I actually knew about as well was these boots from nasty girl because i saw them and they were in sale and i loved them i've been looking for something like these for a while basically they're just a little pair of black boots zip up on the side tiniest tiniest heel compared to what i normally have just thought they might be a bit more comfy and i like the lace-up detail on the front i don't really i have one pair like that but i think i might check them out and just keep these instead because these are just lush and nasty girl have such nice shoes so that is these then I also have this massive Cadbury chocolate selection box and an Elemis Hydro Boost Serum, which is an instant hydrating serum. I also received this, I was very spoiled for my parents this year. I also received this Moroccan oil and I love Moroccan oil, it smells so nice. Um, it's kind of like a two in one. So you have this holiday bag, which hangs up and you can, there's a zip here so you can put stuff in the top pocket and then your this is a travel bag yeah and it's got an intense hydrating mask a hydrating conditioner hydrating shampoo and then the moroccan oil itself i also had a chocolate orange and carrying on with chocolate as well it's from a company called coco therapy now i've never been there before but my mum heard really good reviews about it and went there and it's quite expensive for chocolate think like hotel chocolate but look how cute if i can get them right without falling Ooh. um then i had this molten brown vintage with elderflower bath and shower gel i'm going to just take a second to appreciate the case because it reminds me of the great gatsby it's so pretty and then it's like a little bauble inside of it and then the last few things that i got for my mum and dad for christmas were these dangly star earrings and it's like rose gold bracelet with pink detailing and like little stars as well i've got a little charm that says daughter on it my camera does really does not want to focus on jewelry today but it's a little charm and it says daughter on it with like a purpley pink gemstone underneath and it's just really really pretty and it's a heart shaped charm as well so the next for my brother i had charlie pink and it is a perfume and a body spray and basically it's the scent of vanilla and tangerine and it smells so nice i love charlie my mum always says every time i wear charlie that it lasts so long she can still smell i can still smell it on myself that's one thing that i love about this perfume i can still smell it on myself throughout the day and i also got these which are some drumsticks and they're not just any type of drumsticks they are if i can do this right now they glow up drumsticks right so moving on then from my auntie and uncle i had this really cute bag that says santa is coming or santa's coming and i had charlie red perfume which is really really nice my favorite one and then I also got this snark tuna because I have not got a tuna for my guitar. So I can tune my guitar now. Moving on then. This is one from work. I got I got one thing from work as well. I work with my dad. Um, I actually have three jobs. So I work with my dad. That's my second job. And basically from him, it was a Christmas gift, like a thank you Christmas gift that everyone got. But it was like personalised to each person. Obviously my dad knows what I like. So I had another crate of strawberry lime, a big thing of chocolates and this really, really nice, I don't know what plant it is, but it's a really nice like red flower. And from my co-worker, she didn't get me this 
as a work as a Christmas gift she said it was more of a thank you gift for helping out so it's from the white company I've never had anything from the white company before I don't think and it is this lip balm and mini hand cream which is bergamot amber and vanilla and it smells really really nice and then I did get something from someone else in work in a, and I see him he's really really nice and he got me a little something as well which I really wasn't expecting so he got me this makeup bag um which has an e on it and it's like a velvety feel to it but it's really really nice and it's really personalized and he does the shopping apparently he does it himself he doesn't get his wife to do it and then I also got a strawberry body yogurt from the body shop which this is gonna sound really weird but it smells like cow pollen I love it and for my mum's friend I received this friend's little tote shopping bag and she also got me a makeup bag and mirror gift set and from her daughter Kelly who I work with and hang out with I got this friend's 16 month 2021 calendar 16 months and she also got me a makeup bag which says I'd rather be watching friends which I've actually put in from my cousin now I had some nail and hand care stuff because I've been into doing my nails at the moment like doing it myself we've got gels at home so I've just been doing my nails and being a bit nicer to myself so my auntie then got me a Nivea hand cream intensive with which intensely nourishes and has almond oil in it a conditioning cuticle oil pen with vitamin e in it an amazing thing i think is a professional manicure set from i don't know how you say it but it's l-e-i-p-p-l-e -P -P -L -E, so label so it's this leather case with all different tools i also got this big set of different like buffer blocks so one of them is a four-way one i've got i think they're all oh no, it's a four-way one there's a two-way one and then one two three four five six little buffer blocks as well and i put a file so my feet can stay baby soft so then i have some money off some of my grandparents as well and like a box of chocolates i've got frozen and I had a Bath Maltese Teaser Bar because I love those and an Amazon voucher which actually has really cute wrapping and then my mum's friends I always go to the, well before I went to uni basically I used to go to the cinema with my mum and her friends and because of Covid we haven't been able to go and because of uni we haven't been able to go I haven't actually caught up with them in a while but basically one of her friends got me some Christmas gifts and I wasn't expecting it but thank you so much so I had a lint hello nice to speak to you caramel brownie bar which looks absolutely amazing she knows i'm obsessed with brownies and i'm also obsessed with stationery um very very obsessed with stationery and she also got me this book which is just so pretty it's just a notebook um just a classic notebook lined notebook but it's so so pretty so then finally for my other uncle and auntie from my dad's side I had a Mac gift voucher and I also had which you're gonna have to brace yourself for I think these are the best things I've ever had some little slipper socks I'm gonna take one off you don't have to see my feet it's fine but they've got some on them they are so so cute and they've blend, like this line in which is amazing and they're kind of glittery as well and they are honestly just the perfect slipper socks so then we each get a gift for boxing day and my one was, I don't know how you say it, I think it's Angel Schlesser, probably getting it wrong, Schlesser, I don't know, but it's an essential Eau de Parfum perfume. I don't know what it smells of, but it smells really nice and that's the container for that one, that's the packaging for that one. It smells, it smells so sweet, it smells so nice. It's quite floral, I like my floral stuff, it smells quite floral. I just can't put my finger on it and that's it so that's everything that I got for Christmas and Boxing Day I hope you all had a lovely Christmas and got to spend time with some of your family and it wasn't too bad with all the Covid restrictions but hopefully it was worthwhile and I think it's just made me really appreciate what we've got and what we'll have next year hopefully if we can go back to normal next year now so thank you all so much for watching my video if you did like it don't forget to like and subscribe down below and I hope you've had a lovely Christmas and a lovely Boxing Day. And you'll have a lovely New Year's next week. Next week. 
and I will see you all again next week. Bye!